his movement is a religiously inspired social movement which works around education, dialogue and charity activities. The word hizmet literally means service in Turkish, but in this context, hizmet movement refers to the idea of serving humanity through civil social projects as part of one's religious responsibilities. Well, the movement is also known and referred to as Gülen movement. This is because it is inspired from the teachings and activism of Turkish Muslim scholar Muhammad Fethullah Gülen. Fethullah Gülen is a Turkish Sunni Muslim scholar who currently lives in, United, in the United States of America. He is a follower of Maturidi school in, in terms of his theology understanding, and he is a Hanafi in terms of his jurisprudence school. He is educated in classical madrasa style and mastered classical Islamic texts as well as hadith, tafsir and fiqh. He knows Persian and Arabic as well as his native Turkish. Gulen is also a public intellectual who addresses contemporary issues to his listeners. He has taken up many initiatives which ultimately helped forming the Hizmet movement. Gulen is also a devout practicing Muslim. He is heavily influenced from Sufi scholars such as Mevlana Jalaluddin Rumi, Yunus Emre, as well as some other scholars like Said Nursi, Imam Ghazali, and Imam Rabbani. The underlying philosophy of the movement is its religious motivation to be better Muslims by being better people. The Prophet, peace be upon him, says in, in one hadith that the best of you is the most helpful, the most beneficial to society. So Sayyid Nusi defined the major problems of the humanity as ignorance, poverty and discrimination. Thus people should fight with the, these problems by using education, dialogue and charity. In other words, the people inspired by the Hizmet movement establishes schools, universities, supplementary schools and other educational institutions to fight with the ignorance. Or they engage with dialogue activities and undertake projects with other, cultural and, uh, other cultures and other faith groups. The Hizmet people also engage in poverty reduction, crisis relief projects, free health clinics, water wells and other conventional charity activities around the world. The movement is a collection of loosely affiliated volunteer groups, networks, so thus, thus there is no real central point to gather that kind of an accurate information about the numbers of the projects going on around the world. But it is estimated that the movement has presence in over 160 countries. This means thousands of schools and hundreds of dialogue institutions, as well as hospitals, health clinics, food banks, refugee centers, orphanages and other social projects.